Hey, boss, I got a question. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Just watch a YouTube video first. Uh, no, I was wondering if you've ever used Tenecteplace to treat an ischemic stroke. Oh, no. Don't say that. Why? What's wrong? Did I just hear a thought-provoking question from the emergency department? <laughs> What's gotten into your neurotransmitters? Ugh, I was having such a good shift. It was me. I was reading about a thrombolytic agent, Tenecteplace. Ah, it's quite effective if used within four and a half hours of a large vessel ischemic stroke. <laughs> Endovascular thrombectomy is better. Yes, that would be best. Imagine what you could accomplish by mechanically unblocking large swaths of your cerebral cortex. Yeah, okay. Unfortunately, not everybody has access to thrombectomy, and many patients fall outside the four-and-a-half-hour time frame for thrombolytics. What about that paper published in the New England Journal of Medicine? Continue. You don't know? I know about it. Just remind me. Hang on, I just want to bask in this moment for a second. Over 500 Chinese adults who had salvageable brain tissue between four and a half to 24 hours after an ischemic stroke, but without access to thrombectomy, were randomized to receive IV tenecteplase or standard antiplatelet therapy. What did they find? Tenecteplase resulted in a higher percentage of patients with no disability at 90 days compared to standard treatment. That's very impressive. Thank you. I didn't know you could read.